New Tool Day Tuesday, where I share with you guys the newer useful tools that I myself use that I think you might be interested in. Today's tool is called the Circuit Detective. I did purchase this from Harbor Freight. At the time of this video, it cost $23. And what this tester does is it helps you figure out what breaker is connected to what outlet. And the interesting thing is it does it while the breakers are on and the circuits are live. Included in the packaging, you're gonna find the receiver itself, a transmitter, and the instructions. The transmitter plugs into a standard outlet and it does have a red light, which is an indicator for two things. It tells you that it is transmitting, but it also tells you that you have power at that outlet. The receiver has a power button located on the side. It also has a red light that indicates that it is powered on. There is also a backlit green arrow that lights up when you're calibrating the device and also when it finds the circuit. The circuit detective also makes an audible noise when it does find your circuit. On the back side is another set of short instructions. That way if you were to lose the manual, it doesn't really matter. This will remind you how to use the device. There is also a compartment right here for a nine volt battery and it does not come with a battery. Operation is really simple. You plug the transmitter into an outlet that you're trying to find the breaker for. Using the receiver, you press the button one time that turns the unit on. You scan all of the breakers in your panel one time. Then you go back and you do it again. And when it beeps, you are on the breaker that is connected to the transmitter. When you're done using the receiver, you hold the button down until it turns off. So it looks promising, but how well does it work? Well, let's find out. So the first thing we're going to do is plug the transmitter into the outlet that we're trying to find the breaker for. You're gonna notice that the LED light turns on indicating that it is transmitting and we do have power to this outlet. Next, we're gonna head over to the breaker panel and we're going to take our receiver and see if we can't figure out which breaker is tied to that outlet. Turning the receiver on and holding it sideways, we are going to touch each breaker in the panel, all of them. That is what you do the first time to calibrate it. It's going to beep or not beep. It does not matter because right now we are just calibrating the tool. Now we do it again and wherever it beeps is the breaker that is tied to that outlet. And that is the breaker that is tied to the outlet. We'll check the other ones just to make sure we don't have any false positives. And we do not. Let's go back to this one and that is the breaker. I wanna point out that I have a double breaker right here, and if you had a single breaker, it would work as well. However, the tool is only capable of isolating the breaker itself. It knows that this breaker, although it is a double breaker, is tied to that outlet. So we're going to turn both of them off and then check our plug and see if the light went on or off. And at this moment, it turned the LED off on the transmitter and we do not have power at the outlet. Now, if you're going to work on the outlet, you're obviously going to want to test it and make sure that there is no live power there. But for demonstration purposes, we pretty much proved that this tool works. So some important things to note, it's not gonna find anything in your home that is 240 volts, like maybe your stove outlets or anything like that, but it will find the majority of your standard outlets. Also keep in mind, if you have a breaker panel that has doubles in it, such as mine, well, it's only gonna find the breaker. You're not gonna know which two of that breaker that particular outlet is on. On a single breaker, which is probably what the majority of people have, well, it's not gonna be a problem at all. It's pretty much gonna pinpoint which breaker you need to turn off to work on that outlet. So what are my final thoughts? Well, you know what, for $22.99, I think this is a great tool to have on hand. It definitely works, and I really like the fact that it works on live circuits. Now, of course, when working with live electricity, you're still going to wanna to confirm that you really did shut the power off on that outlet, but this should pretty much pinpoint what breaker you need to turn off. If you like these types of videos, don't forget to like and subscribe. Take a look at some of my other videos. At the very least, you might be entertained.